Uh, Devin Sanchez just announced that she's leaving CBS 7 and and I, I filmed that real quick and because I thought it was interesting uh, as as she seems to be a part of the story of the uh, underground facility the multiple murders at this house uh, uh, you know the capital premeditated capital murder attempt on my life where they where they shot me with a 45 loaded with a special bullet make my murder look like an accident and the the secret place that were secret for six years but but her connection at as a reporter you heard her say she's been a reporter since 2012 she was a reporter for news west nine Okay, and 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 back then uh, she was uh, it, it, actually she was the one. I've got a video where she was deleting news stories off the internet and then reposting them on, uh, per, uh, particularly about Eric Perez, and and he was a suspect, uh, one of my suspects um, that might be connected, and that was because they wanted him for uh, capital attempted murder, and he was running from the police. I thought I saw him in my neighborhood. That's a whole nother story. But anyway, Devin Sanchez was married to uh, former Martin County Sheriff John Woodward. Well, the, the private investigator, when when in May of 2018, when collected the $2,000 reward and, and and named all 11 of the former secret police, said that that John Woodward, her her former husband, was the very first person to show up at my house after I crawled out and survived this premeditated murder attempt. And so I've I've always wondered, and of course CBS Seven has never reported on you know on the many many homes in our area where people are reporting somebody in the attic. They've also not reported the half dozen more people that are saying Haley Dunn was you know was uh, killed and buried over in Odessa and all that and all the other uh, stories that go along with this. Interesting. 